and welcome back to Nora's Cove. I'm Yoshida and here at the Cove we do budgeting, DIY, minimal planning, regular planning, and cash stuffing sometimes. So today this is my first cash stuffing of 2022 and the first one of April. So you guys know I just didn't have it, okay? Just didn't have it, but I'm ready to get back into the swing of things. So what I've done is I've saved like two weeks worth of tips and I actually took away, I'm missing probably about $70 from this. I took out 40 for eating out because I know that we're gonna eat out. And then um, I added, I think 30 to booth rent. So. Here are my binders. They're the same. I do have some new categories, but um, I don't have, I didn't take the time to do the vinyl for them, but let's just count the money and lay it out. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. So we have $135. So yeah, we were close, I think either close to 200 or over a little over 200, but it's okay because thank God we had the cash for it. So I'm going to start with this one first. And I'm going to put one and fives in. Like I said, I was going to save my one and fives to the end, but I want to put five, 10, 15, and then all of the ones. In there, so I'm gonna try to keep up with that. And I su suppose that Ben started this even without y'all, but I just couldn't keep up. And Christmas, Christmas, I'm gonna give Christmas 10. I'm gonna get back on track of giving them 25. Um, taxes, we're not doing those. Savings got $50 this week, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, emergency fund is the same thing, so I'm gonna put that aside. Next up is nail supplies, y'all. We made pretty good money in nails this week, so I wanted to take um, some of it, I really want to take half of it and put it back to nail supplies. But I'm just gonna put five in here and nail supplies. I'm pretty good on everything, I'm running low on some of my favorites. Um, top coat so that's what this mainly is for I don't need any acrylic I don't need any nails don't need glue so yeah we'll give nail supplies five household will get five I need a month I've ran out of my um, Dawn power wash so put this in here but I have some other things I'm pretty good on house supplies because when I wasn't stuffing envelopes, I was on TikTok, got on the cleaning TikTok, and didn't have a budget. Okay, so I'm good. Business supplies, I'm kind of doing a digital envelope for that. I'll explain that later. Um, so I'm not going to put anything in there. Um, ball smooths, I've kind of changed my mind on that one. Um, I mean, I'm looking at something luxury, but I don't think that's going to be it. Bentley gotten, has gotten taken care of, so I don't need to fund him. Vacation, hubby, booth rat. So, my niece is pregnant. She has her baby in May, the beginning of May. So, I kind of have a little bit of money set aside. So, I'll be going to help her with her baby. So, I want to be able to have some of my booth rent. But I think I'm going to put that in the week ahead. Let's, we'll come back to that one. We'll come back. Okay, next up is my Filoflex wallet um, self-care. I just got a pedicure, but I want to save for next time. And hopefully it'll be like in two weeks and that'll be my birthday week. So I'm going to put $10 in self-care. My daughter, I've been giving her money, so I'm going to skip her. I just got products, but I'm going to put five in here. And this is miscellaneous. This is date night. And then this is my week ahead envelope. I'm going to put 25 in the week ahead. Okay. 
now for me not to touch this. And the new one is, oh, I don't have it. Let me see. Car. I'm supposed to have one for my car. I probably got rid of that one, but um, I need an oil change. I'm going to put, it's going to be more than 25, so uh, I better not do that. Uh. Well, we'll do car maintenance, so we'll just put 20 in there. I am getting an oil change. It's going to probably take up most of this, but it'll help out, so... I'll just put 40 in there because my oil changes are like 60. So I'll probably still have to put towards that. And let me just make a note. Since I have not labeled these. Hold on. I know y'all like you forever making a note. <laughs> I guess I just like to. Let's see car maintenance. Yeah, so I have to get my oil changed next week because I may be driving to Atlanta to take my daughter's dog back. So I'm not sure yet. So I definitely have to get my oil changed before I can do that. I'm going to put this five back in. Um, the five dollar. Um, the one in five. And then I'm going to take this 10 and add it to household. And hopefully by my next cash stuff, and I should have um, I need paper towels too. Actually, I need the paper towels for the house and for nails, so that's fine. But the 1 in 5 challenge, I'll put that one in there because I do love saving the um, 1 in 5s. So yeah, so hopefully I'll get back in the swing of things and be a little more consistent. Here we go. Here we go. And so next time we'll be doing totals of what we have. I'll probably update my trackers off camera or before our next one. And then a one in five, I'm not going to do like I did last year each time, just count it because I think that kind of made me want to kind of dip in it. So what I'll do is I won't, I mean, I'll add it off of camera, but I won't pretty much add it up on camera, if that makes sense. We, we paid to debt this week, so we don't have this to worry about. But that's it, you guys. That is my cash stuffing for the week. <sighs> it's so good to get back into my cash stuffing. I was a little leery because I'm like, oh, I kind of need it, but I don't because, um, as you all know, my taxes kind of saved me and helped me. So um, I put my money aside this week. So that was like two weeks worth of tips, and I didn't touch them, and I'm very, very surprised. Like I said, the only reason I touched them was because I know we're going out to dinner, so there's no need to stuff in my little pocket wallet with that, and then um, I put some towards my booth rent. This only so I wouldn't have to go to the bank. Like, I could have easily went to the bank, got the money out, or replenished it, but I just said, you know, I'll just leave it alone and be a little short. So next week, we're going to save our tips. So pretty much, I'm just going to be using my tips um, to stuff my envelopes unless I have a little extra um, I was doing that before but I kept feeling like I was getting further and further behind and I think that's what happened with me towards the end of the year that I was trying to fill these envelopes but then I had to go back in them because I needed the money so yeah so I think my tips will be what I'm using for um, stuff in my envelopes also thinking of tips for my entrepreneurs um, I'm definitely going to do something special for you guys I have a bundle coming up for you. I, I've been working on it actually for some years. I just need to put a little more effort into it and get it out. But um, I just want to show my entrepreneurs that it is possible to save your money, have a budget, live well, eat well. And um, I was talking to Shakisha the other day and we were talking about like eating out, you know, treating ourselves to coffee and things like that. We can have those things, but we just have to set it aside. So maybe make a Starbucks envelope or eating out envelope like i love to eat out so i gotta have that in my budget somehow um because i'm going to do that <laughs> so yeah so anywho thank you all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's video and if you did please um, consider subscribing and also consider hitting that notification bell and i'll see you in my next video bye